What is up guys? Welcome back to my channel. I'm Tatiana if you guys are new and on this channel I love talking all things home decor, motherhood and fashion. So if you're into that kind of thing then be sure to subscribe to the channel and click on the notification button so that you guys don't miss out when I upload a brand new video. I cannot believe this year is come and gone. It has been such an amazing, crazy, beautiful year. Not only because we are still in a pandemic, but because we moved homes this year. We had our son Lucas. I cut off all my hair. Like there has just been so many things this year. And because we moved, I purchased new pieces for this house. And you guys, I came across some of the most amazing dupes to like Restoration Hardware and CB2, a Pottery Barn, and you guys, I need to share them with you guys. So let's get on to this year's top home purchases. Let's start with my curtains. I'm obsessed with my curtains. I mentioned these in another vlog of mine, but I have to mention them again. They are a dupe to a Pottery Barn curtain I found that was like a blackout curtain. And for the life of me, I couldn't find a good quality blackout curtain that was reasonably priced. So I remixed this one from Ikea and I will leave everything linked down below for you guys if you wanna check out every, anything, check out the description below. These curtains are just, they're such high quality and they were like $39.99 for two panels. And then I simply just bought the blackout liner from Amazon, hooked the two together, hung it up and it was absolutely perfect i love them again they're like high quality and they're nice and thick and then with the lining it's like even thicker nicer better blackout all the things so i cannot rave enough about these curtains then i also added the curtain hoops like the hoop clip to string onto your curtain rod which made them look that much more elevated that much more high-end and amazing if you hear any cooing or anything, it's my son. He's sleeping in the corner and he's being such a good boy and allowing me to film this video for you guys. So let's keep it moving. Along with the curtains, I got the most amazing curtain rods from Amazon and they are so amazing. Initially, again, I wanted the Pottery Barn or no, was it West Elm, I think? I think it was West Elm, the uh, curtain rod. They also had them on Pottery Barn, but again, super expensive to like do a lot of curtain because my whole entire like wall of my bedroom is windows. So they all needed curtains and they all needed to be blackout because the sun hits my bedroom first thing in the morning. So I ended up finding a beautiful sleek double rod, exactly like the same design from West Elm or Pottery Barn and it was just amazing and they're from Amazon so it was super super inexpensive and they did the trick and I got them in the black color so they matched the black hoop on the curtain and it was just oh couldn't have been better I love love loved those curtains they were definitely like the staple because I got them all over the house my next purchase is a CB2 dupe. I'm so obsessed with this chair. It is a dupe to their boucle big swivel chair. I initially wanted to get the CB2 boucle chair, that big one that swivels, and it was just back ordered forever, so I couldn't even get my hands on it. And then I found this one on Wayfair, and it was a couple hundred dollars cheaper, and it was able to come in like two days, and it did. It came in like literally two days. I was so impressed. I could not have asked for anything better. It is amazing quality and it swivels, it's beautiful texture. It's just everything that I wanted for the corner of my master bedroom. So I cannot be happier and more pleased with this purchase. Another CB2 dupe that I'm obsessed with, and again, I wanted to order from CB2, but was back ordered until like February, and I just had no patience, where there are bar stools. And again, it was like that boucle bar stool that they have at CB2. This one from Wayfair, again, wasn't or isn't boucle. It's more of like a beautiful off-white, like textured chair, like seat portion of it. It's not the clay, which I wasn't like too mad about, but it's the same design. It's beautiful. They weren't like crazy cheap because I know the CB2 ones for the height I wanted were like $200. And the Wayfair ones were, I think, like one something a chair. So I had to get four. So it wasn't a major savings, but 
I mean, they were able to come immediately and I was so happy. They're great quality, super, super easy to put together and you can't even tell, like you can't see any screws, any anything. So that's like a huge tip when getting dupes is the making sure that you can't see how you put them together. <laughs> All right, my son is awake, but I have a few more minutes to tell you guys the last few items that I have. The next one I wanna mention is probably my favorite, favorite purchase of the year, and it is my bed frame. It is from Etsy, and it is a straight up dupe of the RH Cloud bed. It is so simple to put together. You literally buy a box spring and you put the bed frame over the box spring. I'll leave all the details again in the description box below so you can check it out if you're interested. They are called soft frame beds. Amazing, you guys. And again, like half the price. I think it was just over a thousand dollars for a king size. And they come in all the colors and I'm pretty sure you can custom your color, but they have all the colors anyways. And obviously I got the white. It did take a few weeks to get here because they are custom made, but so worth the time, so worth the price amazing bed and I just I can't say enough amazing things about them and their company so please check them out on Etsy if you ever are in the market for a new bed frame another bed that I bought is a day bed that I had to get for my son's nursery it is the most beautiful perfect little bed and it's actually a twin that can convert into a king which is insane you're supposed to put two thinner twin mattresses on it and then it pulls out and then the second mattress becomes a full king and it's amazing it's super super cute and and like small it has drawers for extra storage and I just I'm obsessed with this bed I sleep on it every day when we take naps in there or if he wakes up during the night I'll like take him to his nursery and like put him back to bed and I'll like sleep with him it is so my, this is like a must have for my nursery even when my friends come over and we're like hanging out in the nursery they'll sit on the bed and i'll be in his chair or like in my nursing chair it's just a must have and it's so inexpensive it was like 250 for a beautiful beautiful little day bed that can convert into a king so you could have it in a guest room as well use it as a couch and then pull it out into a king when you're ready my next purchase is a rug and I'm absolutely obsessed with this rug it is from rugs USA and it's a jute and cotton mixed rug or mixed blend rug it is spectacular quality like I cannot rave enough about this rug it had incredible reviews which is why I purchased it in the first place I was looking for a very modern yet natural rug and this hit all the check boxes for me and again it was pretty affordable as well I think it was in the high 400s for a 9 by 12 and it is just so soft for being a jute rug it's mixed with that cotton so it's it is like super super soft I know a lot of jute rugs can be really rough and just like not nice to walk around um but this one you guys this one is so perfect it's so amazing i love it so much and it reminds me a lot of like a restoration hardware but it with a little bit more of a natural feel to it and the last purchase that i want to mention is a mirror a big standing like full length mirror that i got for my bedroom it is so aesthetically pleasing. I was looking for something along the lines of this huge Studio McGee arched mirror that I found, and this hit the boxes for me. It did come, and it does come in a larger size, and low key, I wish I would have gotten the larger size because this one is just like the tiniest bit too small for me, but it is heavier than anything, and I really don't know how I would have gotten the larger one upstairs. So I am super, super pleased with this one that I have. It is aesthetically pleasing. It fits like what I need it for and it photographs really well. So that's all I can ask for. <laughs> and that is it, you guys. I hope you loved my home purchases of 2021. I absolutely loved everything that I bought and I will leave everything that I mentioned linked in the description box for you guys. Please check them out. I hope you guys had a lovely and amazing, blessed, happy, beautiful year. And I cannot wait to see what 2022 has in store for us. God bless each and every one of you. And I will see you in my next one. Bye.